differently. What, what I wish in a perfect world, we'd have more patient advocacy with regard to insurance uh, carriers. There's a, particularly when you get to some more experimental and non-traditional therapies, there's just not a lot of support for that. People, people have to get authorizations. It's just very difficult to get sort of, I'd say, advanced level care. Um, but I think it's important. I think it's important that patients, you know, go on the web, do whatever they can to improve advocacy for breast cancer. Breast cancer is generally curable if it's caught early. That's not true for all the other things that yes. I treat. Mm -hmm. If it's caught early, we're looking at 90, 95 percent can be cured if it's caught at the time that it's seen on a, on a mammography and it's small. And that's not true. I mean, I'm rarely giving people a conversation where I say anything's over 90 percent in terms of cure rate. But with an early stage breast cancer, that's generally the case. So I really advocate for women to really sort of take charge and to participate in whatever advocacy groups they can because it is the insurance issue is a, is a huge one. The Affordable Care Act has helped quite a bit because of the preventative care strategies that Correct. are associated with Correct. that plan. Um, and so in the long term, I think it will help breast cancer.